If you're building or remodeling a house, I wanna give you my number one tip for attic insulation. I'm in the attic of a house my company recently completed, and I wanna to talk to you today about the differences between a traditional insulated attic and this attic. This is a conditioned attic. You know, most houses in America have the insulation at the attic floor level, and that's not a great place to insulate because there's so many holes in that. We've got recessed cans, we've got AC buckets, all kinds of things that penetrate that and reduce the amount of insulation there and also have air infiltration coming through there. On the other hand, this non-vented attic has spray foam all the way up the roof line. We've got eight inches of open cell foam. And now this conditioned attic does not have any outside air coming in. It's a very temperate place. It's 104 outside, but inside this attic, it's 79 degrees. And my thermostat below and the room below is set at 76 degrees. So we're very temperate. Now all my ductwork is running through a very hospitable place. There's very little difference between the attic temperature and the duct temperature. It makes the house so much more efficient. If you're building or remodeling, I highly recommend you consider a conditioned attic. Hey, for more tips on building or remodeling or efficiency, visit my blog at mattreisinger.com. Otherwise, join me on Twitter or Instagram. We'll see you next time.